Okay, today's Monday the 10th of October, which means it's National Coming Up Day. The day was originally started by the Human Rights Campaign in order for lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender people, uh, as well as their heterosexual allies, to uh, raise awareness of gay rights issues um, of this matter. Um, this year they're focusing on the recent suicides uh, seen by LGBT people uh, when they're bullied after they've come out, which um, a very stressful time in their adolescent age, which most people come out, um, you know, you're going through some real shit um, in your own own self, like because you've just been reborn, as it were, um, and some people can't do like cope with that. Um, one incident uh, recently was Tyler Clemente, um, where after his roommate um, filmed him with another male and put it up on live webcam. So I'm just going to um, address some issues here and go on about it. And at the end, I've got um, a thing for everyone to do if you are interested in um, supporting this matter. So. In the past four decades, we've seen an increasingly amount of gay men, women, um, bisexual, uh, transgender, and transvestite uh, people, um, and others, if you can think of them. Um, you're all out there, and you are all coming out. Uh, one of the big factors are the um, the ban of gay people, really, um, and that was lifted in the 70s. So. We're seeing an increasingly amount of people, um, and that's good. Good, good for all the gays um, and whatnot. Um, before then, and I know this from personal experience because I work with a lot of uh, people uh, who are older, and they um, they didn't know anything better or anything else. You know, when when you grew, you you was taught that when you grow up, you have kids and you get married. Um, and since then, um, it's opened up a huge, big mindset for the, the whole world in the past 50 years or so. So we're getting an increasing amount of alternate sexualities. So this means loads of people are coming out. And this is what this day is dedicated to, um, to actually get the word out there that um, it's okay to be gay and you should come out, but only when you're comfortable, because no one can force you to come out. Um, I mean, you've got famous people in the press and people say, oh, I'm going to out you. You can't do that. It's not your right. Um, the only one thing that's really dear to you when you're gay is actually coming out. So um, I myself um, didn't have the privilege to come out uh, since it was forced out of me by my mum, um, which was mentioned in a previous video, I think. So um, I've got friends who um, have been straight and had a straight relationship for like 20 years um, and being threatened and blackmailed by their friends saying oh, we're going to out you at work blah 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 and I think if you're going to do that you're a proper wanker um, so how do you come out? Well first of all in your own time um, you don't want to force yourself um, sometimes you've got to force yourself in order to do it but you have only have to do it when the time is right um, you can't really tell your parents um, during a bad time, say like death in the family or they're a bit stressed, so you can't really just go, oh mum, I'm gay, like that, because uh, you have to really work up to it, I think. Um, you can either do it subtly or just walk out in makeup and go, mum, this is me, accept me for who I am, dad, you can fuck off what you think, I'm thing. I don't know. Um, but there are many families who obviously are unaccepting um, and that is the main problem, uh, which is mainly the main cause of the suicides, I think, um, especially in adolescent and teens. Um, you're going through a big change in your life, um, so, you know, within yourself as well as the people around you. Um, some people you can go, oh, we, we knew you was already gay, son, or something, but some are proper, you know, some parents are really shocked and they, they can't get over it. Um, might take them days, weeks, or years, or never, never really. Um, one main cause is religious families, and if you're religious, if your family's religious and you're Catholic or whatever, and 
you're gay. Don't think you're the only bloody gay Catholic in the world, because uh, there's plenty of them. And even if you're not, and you have a bit of you know Bible bashing, and someone says, "Oh, God's gonna um, kill you for your sins," you go to hell. All gay people go to hell. All you need to do is turn around to them and say, "Richard Dawkins, deal with it, motherfucker." Because you are your own person, you lead your own life, you don't need someone else to tell you what to fucking do. So, just don't let, let it control you, really. I mean, you are what you are. Um, no one can change that. So, it, it just really depends on how you're going to go for it, really. I mean, you've got... The, the main reason is all these suicides. And it really pains me deeply uh, when I hear about all these these things especially in America but it goes on all around the world and when you've got like uh, Middle Eastern countries where it's still illegal and like Dubai or something or just thinking off the top of my head um, and you don't want to be like publicly executed uh, for that so there are a lot of gay people in the world and they feel they're alone um, in the mass of think oh I'm the only gay person no one else is having these feelings so you're not alone, you've got everyone around you, you've got internet forums, you've got um, groups on Facebook, you've got LGBT groups in your area or youth groups or something like that, um, and just, you're not alone, and that's why I want uh, the people of YouTube, or even if you don't have a YouTube account, uh, Facebook, um, send this video to your friends, because what I want to do, uh, because it's National Coming Out Day, I want people, if you are already out, it, or even better if you're not, why don't you make it a YouTube thing? I mean, I'm not forcing you, of course, but if you think that you want to say something, do a little 10 second video, or 5 second or something, and say, for example, my name's Drake Blaze and I'm gay, and someone else will go, my name's John Smith and I'm a transsexual, uh, or I'm a hermaphrodite, or something like that, or um, I'm a lesbian or something and what I want to do I want to make a big collaboration of all these people coming out to make sure uh, and get the point across that you're not alone in this world and you've got people to help you you've got everyone who should support you because there's no one has got a reason to be horrible to you about who you are and what you are so if you do want to do that either do a video response and send it to me in my YouTube mail or email me at brentwoodlad at gmail.com brentwoodlad at gmail.com I'll probably put it in the description or something so that's all really what I can talk about at the moment for coming out but um, I do appreciate you actually watching this video and I hope um, it's brought some light on the subjects but you know you're not alone and just just do it when you're ready because no one can force it the only person who can come out is yourself so either come out the closet screaming and like come out the closet and into the wardrobe dress yourself up or you know you can just do it subtly in the kitchen but it's up to you when to do it um, and no one can take that right from you over and out